Hey guys, today I wanted to talk about five perfumes that I would take with me on a desert island. Now, before I even start, like, I simply would not survive. Let's be real. <laughs> um, I'm a homebody, I'm an introvert, but not to that extent. The only good thing that would come from all of this is I would maybe finally get a tan, I would look sunkissed, I wouldn't look as pasty, like a vampire. And I think all of these will help me in their own ways. So, obviously, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna have access to a shower, so I'll need something to help me so that I feel fresh and clean. Miami Glow will help me with that. This is literally clean and soapy. I'm not sure how it even works. Like, would I go to the shore, splash some water on myself, and I would have to be careful so that, like, sharks don't jump and eat me? Or, like, would the sunshine and the UV rays help kill, like, bacteria on my body? I don't know, but... I feel like this would help me. But yeah, not having access to shower would just be terrible for me. That would be hell. <laughs> we'll need something warm and comforting. Something that reminds me of home. And something to also satisfy my chocolate cravings. The Tefa Pride Nebrez. Yeah, no, this will definitely make me feel comforted. Like I feel like I have a blanket over me. I love this. I'm gonna need a bit of escapism if I'm all alone in an island just so that I can daydream a bit and escape reality. Lolita Limpica will help me with that. Ah, oh, so unique, yeah. When I spray this, I'll definitely be transported into another well with the fairies in a forest, with dancing mushrooms and the fungi. Yeah, I'll definitely need this with me. Can imagine myself spraying this at night time to help me get dreams, vivid dreams. Mm -mm -mm. This is amazing. I'd wanna take something sentimental with me, something that I have a lot of memories with, whether it's melancholy or happy. Kenzo or more. Mm, this is play doughy rice pudding with smoky incense. Mm, I can just imagine myself spraying this when I'm all alone and it'll just be me and my thoughts and I can reflect on my life. <laughs> yeah, a bit bittersweet, but I like this. I'm gonna need a perfume that will just give me energy to help fight off the cannibals, the pirates, the snakes, the mermaid sharks, you name it. Man Sarah Instant Crush, this is long lasting with good sillage. Yeah, right off the bat, if I need to build a boat <laughs> by hand or by myself or like build shelter or don't even know, I'll spray this and trust me, I will do it. I'll accomplish everything that I need to with this on. Thank you so much for watching this video guys. What are fragrances that you would take if you were in like a deserted island all alone by yourself in the middle of nowhere? Have you ever been stranded in an island by any chance? and yeah let me know when i recording this video i was just thinking about this one case of a little girl who she had a fly and i believe her airplane crashed and she was in the middle of nowhere in an island by herself and i think she had wounds on her body and she had to walk through like the amazon river and i think as she was walking for days and days flies and insects were just eating her body and her wounds and oh my gosh i remember that case from like two years ago and it's based on a true story um, I think I might watch a video on it after actually because it was quite interesting but yeah the whole idea is just scary to me and the fact that people and real life humans have been actually stranded alone goodness my anxiety would take over and I'll just simply pass away and yeah thank you so much for watching this video guys <laughs> have a nice day